Yeah. Morning, everybody. How are we all doing today? Are you good? Hoping that everybody is okay. And today we're going to be doing a vlog. And look at my hair, it looks so fluffy. Living, living for the fluff. Um, and today I'm thinking I'm going to be continuing on with my declutter phase because uh, there's some other things. Let me show you this. So in my wardrobe, I have this list. Let me get it out. I have this list and it has loads of things on here that I've been, that I've been doing. And there's 34 things on here. And I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I've got eight things left to do on here. So I've done quite a lot. I've been productive. I'm not gonna lie though, some days I just wanna literally fall asleep. But on the list today is we need to organize my jackets, coats, things like this, because I have got so many. And honestly, I am pretty sure some of them don't even fit me anymore, or they're just old and they're just not my style and they're everywhere. So we're gonna be doing this. I'm gonna grab all my coats and everything. I'm gonna bring them upstairs. I'm gonna get changed as well. And I need to make my bed because, girl, gotta make my bed. And then I will be back and we will make a start. I'm gonna do like a try on and go through them. And uh, yeah, it will be fun. So if you are here for this, Stick around and I'll see you in a minute. So before we get into the coats, which I have over here, I've got a whole rack ready. So we're gonna be doing this. Before we get into that, I want to show you my plants that I got. So I just got these ones. These are from my mum. Ow. Oh, just bang my head on the window. These are from my mum and these were kind of like a quick fix plant until I get my big one for my pot over there. Over there. But yeah, these are what I have now. So I'm just going to water them and I thought we could water them together. Lovely. So these are my plants. I haven't named them yet. So if anyone can think of any names for them, I'd like to come up with names for them. So I have all my coats here. Lots of different ones. Uh, let me show you the rack. So we've got all these here that we're going to be trying on, seeing if I like them, seeing if I still want them. Um, I want to share this with you guys as well. So this is might be a bit random, but I love uh, candles and these two candles. So this is by CEO Candles and I believe they have a sale on at the minute. I will double check when I post and I will let you know here somewhere. But uh, CEO Candles, this is really amazing. Mm. This one was uh, the Confidence. So they have lots of different ones. This was the Confidence one and it's lavender, eucalyptus and chamomile, and its burn time is 45 hours. This is it here. So this is a small UK brand and I think it's important to show support to small brands, um, especially being like a micro influencer or what do you call it, like a small YouTuber. I think it's important to show love to different people and this is amazing. So there's this one and then there is also this one. This was brought by my friend for me. It's called Relax, Be Kind to Yourself and these are by Lily Flame. Um, as you can see, it's completely gone. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. This smells amazing. Let me see what... Da, da, da. It doesn't say what scent is on here, but the, the name of it is Relax. It kind of smells oh, like a heavenly spa. That's all I can describe it as. But yeah, these are two candles I've been loving at the moment. A little bit random, but um, I thought you might find it interesting, so I'd pop it in here. Now let's get into the first coat. So this is a coat here. This is from Roman. And it's like this. So 
This is quite cute. I like this still. What do you think? Okay. I'm keeping this. <laughs> and then next, I have this. This is by a company called Jumpo. Jumpo. And it's like a leather jacket. I like this. It looks really cute when it's on. The only problem is look. What does this remind you of? White chicks. I can taste the leather. <laughs> I'm like. See, part of me likes this, but then part of me is like, eh. See, I like it when it's open. This is going in the maybe pile, because it's a bit small, to be honest. Next up is this. This is like a tweed coat. This is from George, which is actually Asda, believe it or not. Now this, look at this. This is way too small. It just looks small, doesn't it? Like the arms look small. This is a goodbye. I love this so much though. I, I wanna get another tweed coat. Look, it doesn't fit around my boobs. I want to get another tweed coat that actually fits. So this is a bye. Goodbye. Oh, it makes me sad. Now this coat I know fits. This is my Parker coat. This is from Next. I love it. It's like a J-Lo moment. So I'm definitely going to keep this and it has a string at the back where you can pull it in to give you a little bit more shape. But this is just really nice and comfy and cosy for those days when it is really cold outside. So this is another keep. Keep this. This coat is by, I don't know how you pronounce this, Etenif a Paris. Look, this is too small. I already know this is too small. So this is going as well. <sighs> Goodbye. And this is like a poncho wrap. from W Collection. Like this. This would be quite nice with a brooch or something. If you have a brooch here. I like this. Keep, we'll keep this. This is quite good for a job interview. You know, you don't want to wear like a proper coat. Keep that. This, this is from Tesco, from F&F. &F. It's like, a, I think it's supposed to be sort of crop. I like this, it's cute. I love the kind of Japanese styling of it. Yeah, it's 
beautiful look keep this and this coat honey we already know what this is truly by two the absolute find of the year so far remember the trench coat that cost me like what i think i don't remember less than a tenner i think the video i'll link the oh oh i found my old bank card in there uh yeah the the coat that was what cost me look at look at look how nice it is look how classy it is this cost me less than a tenner i think uh it's it's oh it's uh, worth over 200 pounds such a good find definitely keeping this my dears next this sort of like faux rabbit gilet this is nice The test is if it does up around your boobs. And if it does up around your boobs, then it's all good. a little bit apart there but that doesn't put me off wanting it to keep it it's cute we'll keep this and keeping that next we have this Yves Saint Laurent jacket. From, this is from the Reeve Gauche collection. I love this. Now it doesn't actually do up around my uh, like boobs but I don't mind that because it's the kind of it's more casually it's more casual open more of an evening jacket I would say we're gonna keep this again this was a charity shop this was a charity shop find as well so you find some amazing things if you look We've got one, two, three, four, five, we've got six left. This is from Roman also. And this is a leopard print jacket. Yes. I love this coat. Super nice, super nice, super nice. Keeping these. This is not real either, this is faux leopard. Next, we have this wrap. It's like Burberry. Yes. We're gonna keep this. This was a no-brainer before we even started. This is staying. <sighs> Next, we have this jacket that I made. I did all these pins on here. This is a vintage jacket and I made it, put all pins on it and things like this. So this does fit. Let's try it on. Yeah. This is cool. Like I'm into this. 
This is cold. Keeping this. Next we have, this is from Wallace. Again, another faux. Really soft and comfy. Oh, love this coat. Keeping this one as well. Not really getting rid of a lot so far. <laughs> now this, this has seen better days. But you know, you just have those jackets that are nice and comfy and you just want to wear like a comfy jacket. This is my comfy jacket. So we'll keep this. Do you know what I've decided? I'm getting rid of this. Bye. The first jacket. We'll try this jacket on. This is from River Island. Yeah, this is nice. It still fits, does it? It's a cute leather jacket. And now, this is like the craziest jacket I have. This is by a company called Garani, London. Garani, Stork, London. And this is like a winter wonderland jacket. Look at this. I like to say this is faux fur. Um, but look how cool it is. Just imagine walking around in winter with this. Staying warm and cozy. Doo -doo -doo. So this is a definite keep as well. And I feel like I have more jackets. I'm just gonna do a quick run around just to make sure. Okay, so I found two more jackets, three more jackets. This is by Fenchurch. It's, this is, again, it's just a comfy, casual jacket. It's one that I wear when I want to be comfy. So this is like a comfy jacket. So we'll keep that. Next one, this is by Combat UK. And it's like a camo. Camouflage, just like a nice jacket with a hood. It's quite nice. Again, just for being casual and stuff, it's quite cool. Um, so I'm keeping this. Whew, gosh, you're getting out of breath, honey. And then my last one, this I bought from an old, like a, like a, like a, like an, a charity shop that's for ex-army stuff. So this is actually just the army sizing and things. This is like a desert jacket. This was this was originally owned by someone in the army, which is quite cool. And then that's that's this here, just like this. So guys, that's all my jackets. I'm getting rid of three and I'm keeping one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So I'm keeping six, well, seventeen jackets. <laughs> Whoops, who needs this many jackets? I don't know, but at least we cleared, cleared some of them out and we got over it. Because I'm, I'm a bit of a hoarder, so I'm learning. I'm learning. Either way, thank you so much for watching this video. Hope I inspired you to clean out your closet. And uh, until next time, see you all very soon. Bye, my loves.